Hey there everyone, it's Kyle playing Mega Man 5, the last boss would get up, so now it's time to get down. Gravity Man, one of the more creative robots, he has the ability to change the color of his metal plating on while he squats. But once he gets back down, he's back to normal. This is one of the more memorable levels of Mega Man 5. Like, if anyone remembers anything about Mega Man 5, it's gonna be the Gravity Man stage. Let's check out this sweet gimmick. No! And even that robot there is affected, which is kind of cool. Like, this is just really cool. This is not really something. I messed up my jump. <laughs> How did I mess it up that- look, actually I just wanted to see the game over screen. Like, we're never gonna see it. Unless I just destroy myself on purpose. That's, that's what it looks like. Very minimalistic end song. It just got like... I don't know what it means, but I also just kind of want to reset my life mount. Gyro Man turns out he's a much deadlier robot than you would think, considering his ability is that he has the back of a hovercraft at his back. I mean, of course, yes, we're gonna get more lives here. Mega Man's head is everywhere, but so is the sweet ball and chain construct. You gotta press down, up to slide. Actually, that's kind of neat, but... Whoa, what's going on with the background? Whoa! Okay, that's mind melting. The way it scrolls, not scroll. And that's super cool, like power-ups, they just kind of still behave normal, and the wall doesn't make any sense. It's so neat. This is so neat. This should not belong and everyone ignores it, Mega Man 5. And yet here we are. Big old pit, there's spikes on some place. Uh, kind of a gamble. Who would hang out that far off, anyways? What's the weapon we got? I got gyro attack. So you go down, and you press up or down, and it goes. But that's it. You have one decision point. After it's gone, you cannot decide where it goes anymore. That is the power of gyrating and attacking at the same time. Thanks for the head. So, uh, here's the robot. He tried to stamp me. Didn't work out. Criminal activity. So now I've got the big old gravity pit. What's above the pit? Wow, it changed everything. All right, so you got to get that R. So you kind of need to like. Mm. So you need to do that, but end up a bit more further to the right. It's not the easiest R in the world to get. And in the original, like the original American version, why did I call it the original? The one that most people who are watching this video originally played, if they did, uh, it wasn't an R, because Rock and Mega, they're not the same words. I wouldn't have thought that the Japanese word for Mega was Rock, like that's pretty neat. Language is pretty amazing. I'm gonna rock and roll your feet, but no other organs of your body. The feet is my favorite organ. There you go. Super easy to get. You just kind of jump in there, just, just kind of get it done. I like how these guys are, like, also, like, the weird tomato capsules that are just leaking tomatoes. Uh, they're affected by gravity, too, as they should be. Like, everyone associates gravity change with tomatoes. That, you know, at this point, 2012, like, I think that's a pretty safe bet. I don't, maybe I'm just speaking for myself, mind you, as I tend to do, because I am, after all, only myself. Uh, but I like to think I got my finger on the pulse of cultural osmosis. Check it out, upside down jump! Whoa, it's Gravity Man! You might remember him from such fan games as I want fan the game. It's really warm out, so that's his pattern. <laughs> he jumps around, he reverses gravity for both of us, so we're never on the same gravity. Then he shoots a shot, and sometimes he hops. It's like, good job, Gravity Man. Would you go to the prom with me? And of course, he said no. So you know what? Nuts to that. Romance is dead. He has... Not sure what's up with the, like, meter on his chest. He has, like, a, a meter of some kind. Is it, is, it, is it the gravity meter? Is that how he measures gravity? He has a Newtonian balance in his chest, but, like, why would he be represented with that kind of thing? I don't know. Gravity Man is an enigma of engineering, because we just have to believe that a humanoid robot can selectively control gravity that way. Or he's just, like, I, just, 
I don't know, man, but he makes me purple, and I get a gravity hold! Hold that gravity! While I make this jump, is what Mega Man likes to say. Yeah, so are we just gonna keep going in that order? Like, we're just gonna keep going just like ta ta ta, so then we go ta. So this next just got to go ta. Is this how we're gonna measure this? Has there been no more creation in the artful disposition of the boss portraits on the menu anymore? Is that why Mega Man 5 is the most uh game? Things to think about.